Cannon. What a spectacular day out there in the second round of the Myra LPGA Classic. Take me through what was working so well, but I want to start off. You, you go off number one, bogey. How yeah. do you readjust <laughs> moving forward after that? I think number one is just a very hard hole. I, I, during the practice, I already thought I need to hit the fairway here. This green is very small. You're coming in with a wedge, but still, yeah, haven't managed to hit the fairway either the green. So <laughs> maybe in the weekend I can do that. Um, but yeah, overall today was very solid. Um, I mean, I had some really good shots in there. I created some good chances for myself. I just stayed patient kind of throughout the whole round. So that helped, I think. We saw four birdies in a row here from seven to 10. Walk me through those and how were they memorable in your mind? Yeah, um, so I didn't have any birdies before that. So uh, I just tried to stay patient, hit good shots into some holes um, and roll in some putts. Um, so seven part three, very good. Eight, I think I need to take advantage of that one because it's a short hole for me. I hit an eight iron into the green. Um, and then nine was a good birdie. It's a tough tee shot. Uh, 10, yeah, I hit it quite close, so that was good. So yeah. Just kept it going, I guess. <laughs> you ended up birdieing four of the five par fives out here. How critical is it to take advantage of the those holes, especially in your game? Yeah, I think, um, I mean, I hit it I hit a good distance, so I think I need to take advantage of the par fives. They're all really reachable, so um, that's always my goal, actually, in all tournaments, um, if the par fives are in reach. So um, I think that's just the key in this tournament as well. Did you have any expectations going into today? Uh, not really. Um, I was. I mean, it's my first year out here uh, on LPGA, so I'm just trying to make cuts, actually. <laughs> um, and last week was my first cut I made, so that got me some confidence for this week. Um, but today was just very solid, so I'm very happy. I was about to ask, first cut made last week of the season of 2023. Yeah. As a tour rookie, what do you take away from, you know, that, that tournament last week as you prepare for what the summer is? Yeah, I feel like um, always your first cut you make, it's um, very mentally draining I feel like so I w the last round was not so good last week but um, I think it gives you confidence and you know you can do it so um, gives me confidence for this week so I'm very happy to be here what were you working on specifically you know we were just talking that this is your first time in Michigan you've never seen this course before a lot of our players have been here year after year after year so what was the game plan as you prepared for this week um, so I'm actually having um, Jim Ascati for the, this two weeks, so that's really nice. He has a lot of experience on tour, um, so it's really nice to have him here um, for these two weeks. And I think we just make a good uh, game plan f throughout the week during the practice rounds, and I think that just just stick to it, and yeah, it's been working. <laughs> I was going to say, Gemma's adventuring through <laughs> Europe right now. Um, I know. So is it nice to have someone who's been out here, a, a vet like that, who knows kind of the LPJ tour and knows kind of the processes and everything. Has that helped you these last two weeks? Yeah, I think so. I mean, I was always like, try to have like local caddies or people I knew, but um, I think someone with uh, some experience, I, f I feel like that definitely helps um, out here. So, I mean, it's been working great. I mean, my first cut and now I'm doing pretty good. So yeah. <laughs> what do you take away from this stellar round so far, the lowest round of the week? Um, this is a course where you need to go low to see yourself at the top of the leaderboard and you did just that. So how do you take advantage of that moving forward to the weekend? Yeah, I mean, the first tip I make on, on this course was I really like this course. It suits my game. So I was very excited before the tournament already. So I think uh, that just helped during the tournament as well. And yeah, it's a course you can, I mean, you have a lot of chances here. So um, you just have to take advantage of that and just hit some good shots. And yeah, they will drop. All right. Well, thank you, Manny. You're welcome. Great job. <laughs> thank you.